Okay, start the video. This is a response to Mr. Aaron Newlands. Mr. Aaron Newlands, uh, thank you for this opportunity. Um, the, the big questions. The big questions. Um, number one. Dad helping easier or harder. Dad make, made it very easy at the beginning. He um, bought me the kit, bought me the models, the paints, brushes, etc. Um, and I got on with it. It was a Lancaster bomber, big, out of my sort of league, but bought it, paint, he, I painted it and uh, it was good. And then I went upstairs to my bedroom to celebrate this on my own and I took every bit of the black bomber paint, gloss black paint, because it was a night bomber. I took every part of that up the stairs with me on my fingers and hands on all the white paintwork and wallpaper because I didn't think. Um, so my dad made it harder from that moment on. <laughs> Very hard. Um, yeah, there you go. Well, that was over a minute, right. Um, overall favourite kit, overall favourite kit of mine that I've built, I suppose it has to be the Angel Interceptor because they were something I loved from a child. The second comes my fire truck. Still not finished, but it's almost there. And my motorbike. I'm so pleased with that motorbike. And uh, the, the, the Ferrari I'm building now, as a, as a test for another build, it's perfect. So that's those are my ideal kits, but to buy one it would be a La France fire engine that I saw once when I was a kid. You know the La France fire engine that you steer from the back? That's the one I want. And I know there's a kit for it, but I can't find it. Any help? Appreciated. Um, if I had to improve on my modelling, um, an a, a spray, an airbrush. Just can't afford one. That's. I'd love to use an airbrush. For the moment, that's out of the question. Um, greatest influences on me? Well, there's there's all sorts. There's I could name. I've got a list here. There's Doc Cranky. There's Hamel Bacars, 888, Atomic Dog, Black and Drills, Chancer. Classic Plastic, Kalito, <laughs> Kalito um, Mr. Sk oh, they all Model Pro 72, everybody, they all, they go on so long, I, it just takes more of my time up. Um, uh, and um, at the end of the day, it was basic modelling, Rob, it was basic modelling, it was you that got me totally back into this hobby, because I, I discovered you on YouTube. You were exactly what I was looking for, and you do the you do the biz for me, mate. Every single time, you never ever fail me. You just you are a star to me, Rob. Anyway, that's that one. Now we're really over time. Um, ultimate dream kit and why? Um, it's that La France fire truck again. It's and that's why because I've I've never been able to find it. And if anybody can help me, a La France fire truck, the articulated one that steers from the back for New York. Anyone, please help. Um, right, okay, number six. What vehicle would I ultimately like? That's easy. Um, classic plastic uh, 101's made. What uh, the Shadow Two vehicle? I would ultimately own that. It's a beautiful vehicle. Um, anything I'd like to see done differently? No, not at all. I want this whole community to carry forward. The young people that are coming in is awesome. As long as they can listen to the advice, that's cool. And if they don't, let them come back and apologise. Oh, please help her. <laughs> we'll still help. I would, anyway. Um, um, uh, blah, whatever, what would I like to do? My, did my video style happen organically or did it develop intentionally? No, this was supposed to be a purely modelling channel and it ended up just being everything I do as the last channel, Dangerous Primate. 
that was my last channel. That you know, that has that's got some funny videos on it, but it, it, it modelling no. Advice for new modellers: um, make sure you've got a doctor to give you some medication to calm you down at some point. Um, otherwise, no. Just if enjoy it. Just enjoy it as much as you possibly can, and learn and learn and learn and learn and learn. Um, advice for the new modellers: No, that's it. Enjoy it as much as you possibly can, and just. You make mistakes, you go wrong, we all do, I do it all the time. <laughs> My Ferrari, when you when it's done, you will see, and I will explain the phenomenal things I've just, I've left out, because I can't be bothered. Um, what's the future for modelling and my place? Um, I'll just keep doing what I do. But the future for modelling is ex... ex it just exponentially just goes on because of YouTube and other places like this and modeling forums. It's a model. It's a uh, it's a hobby that I thought wasn't going to survive, but it actually has boomed. It's absolutely boomed, which pleases me no end. Um, makes me a happy person. It's something I never expected in all my days. I thought what I did was a pointless little bedroom hobby, and it's not people appreciate it out there. So does that help you? Yeah. What attitude must a modeler possess to be successful? <laughs> Easy. Insanity and perseverance. Either way. <laughs> insanity, perseverance and patience. And insanity. And patience. And more insanity. Oh, yeah, okay, you get it. Um, what was my worst modelling injury whilst modelling? Well, next to that grand piano that fell on me while I was making the Stuka dive bomber in the living room back in... No, I've never... I've, I've dropped a few scalpels and they've gone through my toes. That's about it. That is it, really. I've burnt myself, I've cut myself. I've probably set myself on fire a few times. Um, that's it, really. <laughs> that's that is it. I mean, I've stuck, I've super glued my fingers numerous amounts of time. In fact, I'm, I'm very good at getting super glued fingers apart. So that's a bonus. I'm always good in an emergency. Um, I don't know if there's anything I can recap on there. Ultimate kit, that's really hard, but I covered it, I got it. Mm. Anything I'd like to see done differently? Um, okay, I'll throw this on at the end. I wish people would just talk about the models rather than just play music over the top of them. It gives it a bit more of a personal touch. I mean, some build, just straight build videos, fair enough. But all this funky dance music to go with the you no know, rock music and all that, I don't think it works. I think it takes away, it distracts me personally from the modelling. You know, going to make a build video and you don't want to talk. Put some war music on or some relevant music. Basic modelling is the game, my hero. If I was going to follow a real model guide, he's the guide I'd, I'd do it by. Because, uh, hey, look, I might as well go and kiss the ass of the guy now. And that ain't gonna happen, and I'm out of time. So, that's me, primitive modelling, and that's my um, whatever you needed to know thing. Love you all very much. <laughs> If I could wink properly, I'd give you a good wink. There you go. That's got to be ten minutes.